Tommy bites, 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 Peace, love, and light. Welcome to Tommy Bites TV. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. Thank you for being here. Go ahead and hit that red button and help your girl out by subscribing. Don't forget to turn on your post notifications, like the video, comment down below, and share the video. How y'all doing today? How are y'all doing today? I didn't have a video for today, so I was like, I don't really have an appetite. I mean, I'm hungry, but I'm trying to not really eat because I had some adult beverage last night at the comedy house. And I'm sure that that had a lot of calories in it. So, I just stopped and got me some KFC. KFC. I got some KFC and the only thing I got was like some hot wings. Ooh, they're so messy. Good lord. They must have just slapped it in the bag. I know they was busy, but dang. Could have wiped off the container. And some good old coleslaw. So this is probably about 600 calories out of the... Uh, might be 650 out of the 1200 calories that I'm trying to stay under. But anywho, how y'all doing today? Let's say great. I'm sorry for the ghetto move bomb. Car bomb. <coughs> Excuse me. Bless me, bless me, bless me. And thank you if you said bless you. Forgive the back. I had I just went shopping again. Or more things my husband and you know he likes to prep we used to be into the prepper shows we used to sit and look at the prepping shows all the time and people are seriously out here prepping not just for the coronavirus just in general if something were to happen and things were to shut down and him being a trucker he knows if the trucking industry shuts down for whatever reason it's going to be hard on everybody because that's how we get our goods our supplies mm. Mm. and trains and shipping mm. and right now with the coronavirus, they're talking about not getting goods from China. So stores like the Dollar General, not Dollar General, Dollar Tree, and some other store, I can't remember. They're probably going to, if it continues, they're probably going to run out of things by April. So y'all, get your butt up in that Dollar Tree and get your stuff. Mm-mm. What's the deal? So I went shopping. What's the day? Sunday. I went shopping Friday. Mmm. 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 Oh my god. This feels like a cheat day. I guess it is. But I'm still trying not to go with my calorie count. Mm. Sundays are usually my chill day. I don't record. I sit and watch movies all day, but I ain't did none of that. Mm. Now, I don't believe in fear. I don't know about y'all. What's your thoughts on people going out and buying up a lot of stuff? But see, 
Like I said, we've always done it, whether anything's popping or not. And it's a lot of stuff, y'all, that the news is not telling us. The news, like CNN, just know whatever they are telling you. My lighting just changed because of the sun. What she said? Oh, my daughter. Me 50,000 messages. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, whatever the news is telling you, just know it's so much more they're not telling you. Um, but like I told my husband, I don't believe in. Um, The whole fear thing and running out doing this and that. That's not what we're doing. We're operating on caution. It's no different than the saying a natural disaster hit. But who's to say that the coronavirus, because now it's two different strains, one is worse than the other. Who's to say that that wasn't somewhat like a biological type weapon that they were testing out? One to eliminate some of the people over there in China because there's so many. Two, China has been buddying up to North Korea. So who's to say that they weren't testing things out for it to get over here and see what it does? Just a thought. Just a thought. I'm not saying I believe it, but that's just a thought. Trust and believe the government is preparing themselves. Everything they telling y'all, oh, don't worry about running out and getting a mask. They getting them. Don't worry about going out and getting all them gloves. They getting them. So. We stocking up on stuff because if the schools just happen to close. You know what I'm saying? Your kids at home, you need tissue, you need paper towels, you need soap, you need clean supplies, you need food, you need, you know, the the meats and the canned goods and all of that stuff. I'd rather be safe than be sorry. Don't be stuck saying... I ain't going to get none of that stuff. Ain't no difference if you knew a storm was coming. You run out. And you get your supplies. You know. Your water, your tissue, your milk, your bread, your all of that stuff. thing my husband's a truck driver right so when he's driving he knows this stuff like when he passed by farms and farms usually be producing food at a certain time and if he go back by there the following year at the same time and they're not that means it's gonna be a shortage 
of, of food because they're not able to produce like they were producing for whatever reason whether it be drought or whatever flooding whatever so y'all just you know I'm not saying go out and buy up the whole stuff but I promise you I've seen videos of people buying up the whole store don't be caught out here and something happened and you were trying to run to the store at the last minute when you should have already been prepared. And I'm sorry for looking so bad, but I have to go on my walk and I had to go to the store. So. Well, no need in getting all dolled up. y'all that comedy house was so it was good i enjoyed myself i enjoy uh, all of myself y'all ever eat y'all coleslaw i know you eat mashed potatoes with the chicken but coleslaw with the chicken now who coleslaw tastes good with the chicken Bye bye. Trust me, y'all. It was good. So leave me some comments. Let me know what y'all think. What some stuff y'all might have been doing to prepare just in case. You know, school clothes. You got to feed them babies at home. Because mine eat like I don't know what. Mmm. I am drinking. Mm. Uh oh. I didn't buy nothing from there. Alright, this can of Sprite. Oh, it kind of washes out. This Sprite. Can you see it? It's the zero sugar, so. I ain't drinking my calories because there's no calories. It's zero calories. Only thing it has is like 25 milligrams of sodium. I don't even know what it tastes like. I just saw it so I get it. It's okay. It's still got that uh, kick that I need. Because I be wanting soda so bad. But I'm not really a Sprite drinker, so. I still got my water with my drink in it. My little drop it thing. Mm. So y'all just want to come to y'all real quick. Say hello. How are ya? I hope you're having a... Uh oh. Oh yeah. Okay. A couple more pieces of chicken. But anyway. Hope y'all having a good, 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 good Sunday. Mm. Mm. I sure went live. I know I wouldn't have to upload it. Mm. I promise y'all that's so good. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and help me out. Share me out. Like the video, subscribe, comment down below. Are you going to be buying you some stuff? Just in case. Just in case your job closed. You never know. Mm, 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 
Okay, y'all. I'll see y'all later. Remember, I love you, but God loves you more. He created only one you. Be the best you that you can be. And when you are, go out and spread God's love. Peace, love, and light. Thank y'all for joining Tom by Phoebe. Out.